all right now i'm going to show you how you can remove common words uh, from your twitter data common words are those words which are occurring most frequently in your data for example let's say if i say x is equal to let's say this is this is okay bye all right so with this what do you get here this all right so this is actually <coughs> this one this is occurring for two time that means this is a uh, most frequently occurring word in this data since this data is small and we can see it with our visual system and we can identify that okay this one is occurring most frequently in this text but in the twitter data you have a lot of words million of tweets and uh, you know the billion of words it's difficult to find out manually so we have to write here an algorithm and uh, let's say we have here our df the data frame in this data frame we have here tweets all right so this is a series now i'm going to join this series in a single text all right you can join this series in a single text by calling here join dot join all right then it is going to join this whole text in a single text i'm going to read it in a text now i have got here this text and total number of characters in this text is total 273607 all right perfect so this is the number of character in the text now we need to get the words in this text now we can get those word with the text is equal to text dot split with this we will get here the total number of words and with the length we can find out that there are total 54242 words all right perfect so once you have got it then we are going to calculate here the frequencies all right and with the frequencies we will be able to find out what are the words which are mostly occurring in this tweet data all right so this is the text data now i'm going to convert this text data in the pandas series all right so in the pandas series i can convert it with the pd dot series all right and uh, then i'm passing here text all right thereafter once you see that now it is become here a panda series once it becomes a panda series then i can call here value underscore counts then it is going to count all of these words and how many times they have occurred so it says that there are total 9172 uh, 9, unique words and most frequently occurring words are these words which are actually a stop words all right so i'm going to say that here freq underscore common all right so this is the commonly you know the most occurring number of times these are the most frequently occurring words and then i'm going to select here the top 20 words f20 and then i can get those words from this text data like this now we have got here a first 20 words all right so that is the f20 with this these are the words which have occurred mostly in our data set and if you see it carefully you will get that these words are mostly coming from a stop words so the stop words are most frequently occurring words in your text data all right now i am going to remove all right so now i am going to remove those text data all right so what i am going to do here i am going to actually all right so i am going to do here a for loop df tweets dot apply lambda x in inside this lambda function i'm going to apply here a for loop and uh, the first of all i'm going to use here a joiner that is a space joiner which we have been doing uh, which, which we have been doing earlier 
Thereafter, I'm going to put here a comprehensive list. And if you remember, we have been doing like this for t in x dot split. All right. Then I'm going to check here if t not, sorry, if t not in f20. That's mean if a particular token is not present in these text data, then I'm going to put that t here. All right. Thereafter, I'm going to save it in the new data set, a uh, new column actually, df tweets once again. All right. Perfect. Now, if you see here, this df with the sample of 5, all right, you will get here these tweet data and these tweet data do not have these most frequently occurring words. And these are the most frequently occurring words, top 20 words. All right. Perfect. Superb. Alright. So this is all about in this lesson. Thanks a lot for watching it. I'll see you in next lesson.